here we are again, just like the other day, with more information revealed about the brand new 123 Pokemon Journeys opening theme that releases next week. The official Anipoke Twitter account has now revealed two new images from the opening, and man, I cannot wait to talk about them. One of the images confirms the return of six traveling companions, and the other teases the return of two very beloved characters. Be sure to like and subscribe if you're excited about this news. We're less than 5,000 subscribers away from 50,000, and that would be an absolute dream. Comment below your thoughts about these amazing character returns, and without further ado, let's get into it. So, first off, this animation frame from the new opening theme was just released. It shows Kiawe, Sophocles, Gladion, Lily, Mallow, and Lana. That's right, the entire Alola gang are returning in Pokemon Journeys. And this time, Lily and Gladion are with them, back in their main clothes. So does this mean that Lily and Gladion have found their father? Or maybe we could even be getting a story arc where Ash, Go, and Chloe help them find their father. I'm so excited that Lily and Gladion are finally returning properly. It's so long overdue, and I cannot wait to see their progress since Sun and Moon. And that means that Snowy, aka my lookalike, is returning too. And that is so exciting. And of course, we can't forget about the other Alolan companions too. I cannot wait to see what they've all been up to. I even made a video about Sophocles and Kiawe, and how they're going to return to challenge Go with catching Mew, so be sure to check that video out using the link at the top right of the screen. I'm super proud of that theory. And finally, another image was released showing a scene from the new Pokemon Journeys opening theme. Take a look. It's Chloe and Eevee wearing fancy costumes. Immediately to me, these resemble the outfits that coordinators or performers would wear during contests or showcases. But if you look closer, there's something incredibly exciting about their clothes. Chloe has the exact same collar, hair bow, and earrings as May does in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. And Chloe Zeevee has the exact same hairpin ribbon as Serena Zeevee had during the X and Y series. Now I don't know about you guys, but that screams to me that Serena and May could be returning. Why would the writers purposely give Chloe and her Eevee May and Serena's exact same outfits when they've never ever ever done anything like that before? All clothing has been unique in the anime for like a decade. So they made the conscious decision to give Chloe the same clothes as Serena and May. And this is where it gets exciting. We know that Wallace and Licia are returning in Pokemon Journeys. So what if we do get a Wallace Cup arc featuring May and Serena, where May and Serena tutor Chloe to compete in the tournament? That would explain why Chloe has May and Serena's clothes. They must have given them to Chloe for the tournament. And it just makes so much sense for May and Serena to return for a Wallace Cup arc. I genuinely cannot get over my excitement for this possibility. We could actually be getting May and Serena returning if this major hint is anything to go by. So, those are the only new images released so far. The fact that these images have already confirmed Licia, Wallace, Clement, Bonnie, Lily, Gladion, Mallow, Lana, Sophocles, and Kiawe, and have possibly hinted at Serena and May too, is so beyond exciting. And new images are going to be released every single day until the opening releases next week. Can you imagine if we get every single traveling companion group shown in the new opening? This is the 25th anniversary of the anime, and we've already seen so many characters. This opening could really go all out and show us everything. I am gonna pray for that. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're just as excited about these major character returns as I am. Be sure to like and subscribe, and also comment your thoughts about these major reveals down below. As always, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one.